Welcome back, woke kids and hello newcomers. In today's video, we're going to be doing a Littlest Pet Shop unboxing because Littlest Pet Shop is back. I can't believe it. I actually really like Littlest Pet Shop. I grew up with it. I believe I had a few of them when I was a child and then the TV show came out. Um, so I, I always watch the TV show and I'm glad that they're making these again. I can't wait to see what they come out with. So we got three boxes from Target. Um, I forget how much they were, like at least six or seven dollars each, I believe. Um, and they come with some things, so we're going to be unboxing them. We're going to be looking at the little booklet that comes with it and uh, seeing what we get. And I'll be showing you the little booklet, the little coin, and the little card that comes with it. And then we're going to do some Roblox because that's how you... Um, do the little coins because they come with like redemption codes and uh, it was actually really fun playing it online on the Roblox I was surprised at how detailed the game on Roblox was all right, so we're going to get into our first unboxing. And here's the little redemption code that you type in. It's just a little coin. And then here's our card. I think this might be a corgi or a chihuahua. I'm not so sure. It looks more like a corgi to me. And then they show rarity, uh, and then they show the level, and they show personality, and they have quite a few animals to collect. I really like the um, jungle or like aquatic types. That's what I would hope for. And they also have like a, I think like a forty dollar play set that actually comes with like a little, uh, you know, like the little pet shop with. Uh, the hamster wheel and like beds and stuff like that. So I hope they continue to have more sets like that. Instead of just, you know, mystery boxes. Because you can end up getting doubles and stuff like that. And this, uh, I'm just going to say it's a corgi. She came with a princess crown. So I really like that for an accessory. And they all have the LSP on the back of their heads. Like, it's in orange, so it might be harder to see on uh, certain animals. But they all have that on the back of their head. And then they all have holes on the bottom of their feet. Probably so that you can play with them in different play sets. Alright, now we are at box number two. And here I have a... Um, hungriest level one core, so I don't think he's rare at all. Number 13, though, that's cool for me. Um, I can't tell, like, if he's a gecko or a lizard. Like, I can only go off of, like, his curly tail or, like, the bumps. But it's obviously, like, some kind of, um, lizard. Some kind of, like, reptile. And then he comes with like a little leaf. He can't really hold it or anything. But I really do like his colors. I like the orange and yellow with the green. And then box number three. And I believe this is a lion because they have other tigers that actually have stripes. I just wish he was more a uh, brown color instead of an orange um, because the orange like really threw me off. I like the eyes though and I like this little succulent or like leaf um, kind of like plant or barrel that it came with. It's really nice for the aesthetic. And then he was hungriest level 2 exotic 
So I like that I got something other than Core. Exotic sounds good. I know it's not a rare, but I got pretty lucky with these three. I didn't get any doubles. They were the last three on the shelf. So that's all I had to choose from. So I'm pretty happy with getting these guys uh, right away. And now I'm going to show you like um, the booklet. And I circled the ones that I like. So like I like the tigers. I love monkeys. Um, I like the giraffes. And any of the like fish or sharks. Like the aquatic stuff. Like the sharks are so cool. And the little dolphins and stuff. So I can be pretty picky on what I like. And now we're at the Roblox game. So I'm just redeeming my code. And I'm showing you guys. You just kind of like go in there. Go up to the like one of the pet carriers and type in your code. And then you'll get um, some money I believe. And like you can pick. Uh, you hit E to shop. And then the like animal is random. And you could choose to keep them or not. And then as you advance through the game, you get uh, more rare pets and you collect money when you play with them and you do different activities. Um, so you do leave the shop and there's like a whole world to explore and you go to different levels, different areas, and your pets can do different things. So it's actually a really good uh, game. I was shocked at how well it played and how uh, fun it actually was. Like I actually was a little bit addicted to it. And the animals are so cute. And I haven't beat the game entirely yet. I'm still, you know, working on it and I will continue to work on it because some of the animals to get them are quite expensive. They're just so cute when they start doing their little activities. And you can actually give them clothes. You can dress them up as you unlock things. And they basically do all the work for you. Alright you guys, that's the end of our video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. <laughs>